Okay guys, well, I'm back at her. Working on the CJ lift again. So anyway, what's going on here? Uh, I took the axle out, put it underneath my springs. Give me about four and a half inches of lift or so. Uh, so what I've already gone done is I... Okay, so what I've done here is I've loosened off the nut that holds my pitman arm on. Uh, Took off the steering, disconnected it. Now what I'm doing, there you go. Now what I'm doing is putting in my spring perches, putting in my new U-bolts, that is new U-bolts. Got a lot of excess here to cut off here still, no big deal. That's fine, got them a little bigger just in case. So now I gotta do the other side. Now guys, be sure when you're doing a lift like this, you take into account this right here. One of your U-bolts your U bolts is gonna go right around this, which requires it to be bigger. So make sure when you take off your old U-bolts, you bring them in, get them sized accordingly, and have them made. Alright, well, just as I suspected, well, what I gotta do here, I gotta notch up just a little bit around the edge here. Because I have to make way for that edge right there. No big deal. Just a couple extra minutes, nibble away at this with the grinder, no big deal. What I'm pretty much doing right now is just snugging these up just to hold it temporarily. I'm not welding this thing in this position. This is just well, pretty much just to hold it together. Uh, what I got to do is check out my uh, my steering angle since I'm not going too crazy with a lift. I'm not going too crazy with a drive shaft angle either. Uh, so pretty much this will just snug it up for now. Then I'll uh, check out my angles, get my diff situated exactly where she should be. Once this is all secure in here, I find my angles. And what I'm gonna do is tack this in here. Once I get the perch situated where I want it, I'm gonna pull the whole thing out of here again, weld it all nice, strong and secure, and then put her back in. The only reason I'm putting these wheel nuts on is so it's rollable and I can move it around if need be. Okay guys, well, I'm done part two for the day. Uh, it's actually sitting pretty high. A little, uh, little crooked at the moment with only the front end lifted up, but uh, it's looking pretty good. Here, check this out guys. There's the back. And there's the front. Let's see if I can get the whole thing in here. There you go. So far it's the front half of spring over left. Have a good one, you two.